chapter wise list of all my videos is available at this point for dvd pen drive please write an email to me these videos they do not require internet they play offline there is no problem of buffering and please subscribe to my channel for regular updates thank you thank you for your support once again let us take up a few solved examples on similarity and the various results that we have discussed in our previous tutorials these are the solved questions that we shall be taking up in this tutorial let us start with them one by one in a triangle abc there is a point d on bc such that ab by ac is equal to bd by dc and angles b and c have been given then what is angle bad we can start by drawing a diagram so that we understand the things very clearly so let this be our triangle abc a b and c there is a point on d point d on bc so let us take a point d here such that ab by ac is equal to bd by dc let us join these two first of all so what he has given us is if ab by ac is equal to this bd by this dc if i remember the result that we proved in our last tutorial let me recall it for you so let us see it on a rough side remember we proved that if this is a triangle abc and this is an angle bisector of angle a cutting bc at d if the angle bisector of a cuts bc at d then we proved at that time that ab by ac should be equal to bd by dc i told at that time also that questions in previous years are being asked that require you to remember some results and this was one of the results that i told you there if we compare our given question in this ab by ac has been given equal to bd by dc that is this thing has been given to us and nothing has been given about these angles but we can very safely assume that if this is the situation then these angles will be equal to each other even though we proved it the other way round that if this angle is equal to this angle then this will be the ratio but we can utilize this result in the reverse order that is if this is the ratio then this is the angle bisector now coming back to our diagram let us mark this angle as x and this angle as x because both of them are equal by virtue of this relationship next angle b is 70 let us mark angle b as 70 degrees here and angle c is equal to 50 degrees let us mark this angle c also as 50 degrees next he says then what is angle bad angle b b a d means this angle this this that is we have to find out the value of x required x 
I don't think it is a very tough problem now because the sum of angles of a triangle has to be 180 degrees. So we can say 70 x and x will be 2 x plus this 50 should be equal to 180 which implies 2 x plus 70 and 50 they add to 120 equal to 180 which implies 2x is 180 minus 120 take 120 to the right side we can write it as 60 which implies x is 60 by 2 equal to 30 degrees is the answer so we can see that in our case our knowledge of this ratio it was the breaking point that helped us to write these two angles as x and x and of course the remaining is just the sum of angles of a triangle being equal to 180 degrees and we found out that x should be 30 degrees. Let us move to our next question now.